Today I'm going to be making a quick and easy card using some stamps and some pattern paper that I grabbed from my um, scrap drawer. Um, so just to go briefly over what we're going to be using, sometimes I may or may not use everything here, but I'm going to show you what I'm planning on using. Sometimes it changes a little bit, I'll let you know. But basically, uh, I'm going to be using some circle punches, some foam dots, um, a stamp. This one happens to be a birthday um, theme stamp. Some just uh, some scissors, some nice sharp scissors, black ink, a heart stamp, um, tape adhesive, and um, just a sanding block. And as far as the papers, I went through my um, stash and I picked out some papers that I ended up cutting down. I'll give you the measurements. I'm also going to throw in some yellow in here. So I've already cut down my paper to strips. These are basically the sizes that I'm going to need. And for those of you that want to know the sizes, this is about oh, two and a half inches long and a half an inch wide. So we've got three of these. And I chose three, um, three different kinds of textures. This is some textured cardstock. It's actually Coordination's cardstock and we're going to stand some of that down for some texture. Um, some patterned paper and um, some glittered cardstock. And then I've got three sizes of paper. I'm going to layer them on each other. I like to work um, with card fronts and adding those to my um, cardstock later. So I'll glue that to the top. I just like to work with just a flat piece of cardstock. And I've got a little bit of some that cardstock and I'm going to stamp my greeting on here. Just taking my stamp. Here's my stamp. I'm going to cut this out first. I'm going to cut in a little bit because I want to be able to take my punch and go right there in the middle. And I'm going to try to get my monkey as far in the middle as I can. What I'm going to do is I'm going to add, uh, I'm going to color that parachute right there at the top yellow. So we're going to do a little overlapping. Um, so I'm happy with that. I'm just going to punch that out. Whoops. Okay, so I glued all of these papers together. I'm going to set that aside. Uh, I'm going to take some yellow cardstock again and my stamp. I'm going to stamp this image one more time and I'm going to set this aside again and next I'm going to work on my strips. Now if you've got um, a heart punch this would work. Um, you're going to need to um, and I'm just going to cut, I'm going to uh, make some pennants with this using um, the end of my um, heart punch and I'm lining this up the bottom of the heart with the end of my strip and I'm just going to punch and it punches a notch um, at the end of that strip and that's how it looks like. Really easy. You can also just cut out a triangle using um, scissors so um, you don't have to do this if you don't have a heart, uh, you don't have to use a heart punch if you don't have one. Okay, so I'm going to take a pen. I want to add some um, dimension um, and texture. So I'm just going to kind of um, put some curves in my um, um, strips like that. So they pop off the card a little bit. And I just used a pen or you can use a pencil. Next you're going to punch your two inch circle and I'm going to glue my monkey right on top of that and that's how my monkey looks like. I'm going to set this aside and I'm going to go ahead and cut out this portion of my parachute and come right back. And just to show you what I did here, 
I went in and I cut that parachute out, but I left the outline, um, I did not cut the outline out so that I can just pop that right um, onto my, um, my parachute right there. It's just a preference of mine. You can include the outline if you like. And I'm gonna take my pop dot and add this to the back. And let's just pop that right on. Great, that's how that looks. And okay, and just to um, help me position these strips, I'm gonna use my um, little monkey there. And I'm gonna tuck this behind where exactly where I want it to help me um, oh, let me backtrack a little bit. I put some glue on the back of the strips so that I can just press them down where I want them. I don't want this circle to overhang on this left side, so that's why I, that's basically why I'm doing this. Um, so I can um, put these strips in a specific, specific um, arrangement. And once you've got it where you want it, just press down really well. Just adding that right over here on top again so that I can glue it down. And now I'm ready to add the rest of my um, parts of my stamp. So I'm just gonna take this here and just cut it out right there. And I'm gonna take this one and cut that bottom part out. And I think I want it to sit right over there. And I'm gonna pop that up with my pop dots. Okay, and that finishes the cards. So there's um, just a really easy card using stamps and scraps of card stock and creating an embellishment. It really can save you a lot of money um, where you're not using handmade flowers or pre-made embellishments um, on your cards. So um, stay tuned for the next card. Let me know if there's anything specific you wanna see, um, any kind of project using a specific punch so just um put that in the comment section or email me whichever you prefer hope you enjoyed that thanks